If I thought that um, I could keep the dog doing exactly the behavior they want and they wouldn't snap break off from it as I rewarded them and I could repeatedly do that, then I would probably, I could say good. Like we do with the sit, right? Yeah. So the dog's in a sit and I want him to hold it. I can say good, give him a piece. Good, give him a piece, right? And they can keep doing the sit that we're working on. If I'm doing this, every time I go to give them a reward, they may or may not keep doing what I want them to do, right? They may have to drop their head to access the reward. They may surge forward. They may do a whole bunch of things in between. So in order, since I know they, they, that there's a strong chance that they won't keep performing this behavior as they ask it, then I say yes. That way, it's like, we're practicing this. Yes, that's what I wanted. We break it off for a sec. We reload. We start again. Yes, you get a reward. We break it off. We reload. You start again, right? So that way, each time, I'm sure that they know they didn't have to keep doing it. As we progress, the place we'll use good here is when they're in the act of doing it and we want them to keep going. And then still when I reward them, I'll release them with a yes. Because eventually our hand is not going to be their target anymore. So in the beginning, when we start here, this is just luring for muscle memory. When we actually start healing, we're going to take our hand away and make them look up at us and give them a focal point on our body for healing. Our eyes, the side of our head, whatever. We're going to teach them to look up at us at a certain place. And then in order for them to be focused on a point, and then be released to, re, uh, to access a reward, they have to stop looking at that point to access a reward. So then let's say my dog's looking up at the side of my head and I'm healing, and I say yes, and I pop my hand up like this, and they jump up and take the food, right? Which is what it's going to look like when we're healing. When we're actually healing, at that point, they're going to break the position to access their reward, especially when we go to a toy. So what I'll do is the dog's healing, watch, good, good dog, yes, wham, right? And when I go to reward them, I'll release them out. Oh, 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 oh,